Hey, I'm John Grant, and welcome back to the Johnny Grant Show. I'm here with Darian Kim and Mo Hadzi. First off, guys, how does it feel to be my first guest on my own show? It feels amazing. I mean, it's an honor. I've been watching the Johnny Grant Show since I could breathe, since I could talk, yeah, since I could walk, and it's just an honor to finally be on here. Man, it's an honor to have you on here. So today, we're going to be ranking Kanye albums, who is one of our favorite artists. So he has 10 solo albums. And it's, it's pretty simple. You write it on the whiteboard, we'll all write it, and then we'll flip it on the count of three. And yeah. I think this should be a pretty uh, universal answer. I just flipped it on accident. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Yeah, yep. Jesus is King. It's, uh, it's just not that good. And I wish we got Yandi instead. Yeah, it just sounds unfinished. Yeah, Follow God's the only like listenable, really song. Uh, no, the I'm a fan of On God. Yeah. On God. They uh, remade nah, it. I don't listen. To, I I really I can't say that I go back and listen to any. Even Follow God, I can't say I go back and listen yeah, to any song true. on this album. Not which really. Is, which is the, which? Is, out of all of his other albums, I listen to at least a couple other songs from the album. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one, flip. I got yay. What? That's a whole, that's yay. horrible. What is I'm wrong a with yay you? hater. I am a yay. What is wrong with Why? You? Why? It's just not a good. It's not a good. The only I have three highlighted songs. Violent Crimes is the most overrated Kanye song. It's the most overrated Kanye song. It's not. Though. And the only three songs: Ghost Town, No Mistakes, and Yikes. What is what does Donda have over? What is wrong with Donda? You? Jail, Heaven and Hell, believe those, what I you, say, those bro. songs suck, dude. No, they don't. They're oh, all no, they with you. You got bro. This this is not. I never go back and listen to that album ever. I, I never. Ever. I have never gone. The, on, the these are the only three songs: Ghost Town, No Mistakes, and Yikes. Violent Crimes is overrated. Donda is underrated. What songs would you take on Donda over any songs on on Ye? I would take. Heaven and Hell. That song is not. It, the original was better. They moon. Ruined, they moon. Ruined. I would take Moon. moon I would take Moon. Or I would take Terrible. Moon I never listened to that song. Jail sucks. Jail is on, way too on, long. Ghost uh, Town. Besides these, and maybe Violent. I've taken Violent Crimes. All of these. Ghost Town, No Mistakes, Yikes, and Violent Crimes. Everything else, though. Donda is just, bro, it's seven songs. It's, it, how, it's not seven even four great albums. songs. Donda. It's not seven great Donda's songs. Donda's so, four great Donda's songs. Donda's way too long. All the Donda's songs way too long. Sounds to finish. Too many features. Too many features. You can make that argument, but I th it's definitely very close. Like even in my list, in my list I have on my computer, I had Donda at nine and Ye at eight, but I just made the impulse decision. Ready? Three, two, one, flip. Yeah, I expected that. Donda, right? Donda. I mean, right. this was bound to happen. Yeah, but I mean, Donda and Ye. But why? Let me. I'm just. I'm a Donda fan. I me, like Donda. Let me speak my truth on Ye. All right. Okay. Speak my truth. The, the co on the cover of the album. I hate being bipolar. I hate being bipolar. It's, it's awesome. What does he mean by that? What do you think? What does the he whole mean? album is just talking about what it was going on in his headspace right now. Yeah. Opening bro. track. You I thought picture? about killing you. He talks about killing himself. He talks about loving himself more than others. Do you know how powerful that track is? And you got Donda over. What does he talk about on Donda that's like important Donda, at all? Donda. Nothing. Life of the party, bro. Life of the that party. That song wasn't even originally <laughs> on the album, dude. Okay. Andre 2000 carried. He did. The yeah, original, they really should honestly, have, they should have the original Kanye OG verse is way better, so but much better, so much better. Number seven. Ready, three, two, one. Yo. What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> All right, bro. Cut. Listen, to I just think I never go back and listen to it. It's not influential. Yes, you do. Not, no, yes, you do. How, you, you literally do go back and I listen, listen to it. I listen it. to Dark Fantasy. I listen to. That's it. I'm. I'm. I'm not. You don't, a big you don't fan. listen to Gorgeous. You don't listen. Gorgeous. to the Devil's New Dress. Compared to other albums, compared to other albums, I don't. All the lights, power. What's wrong with this, you? This this album is literally. Like, okay, listen to me. Uh, this, this is not. This album is more than rap, and you have this. Let this me explain. Let me explain album? myself. Let me explain myself. Okay. Runaway's outro is way too long. You that is know, fire. I, it's way oh too long. You do you even know? Do you even know the meaning behind there, Runaway's to, outro? You don't even know me. what it means. Explain it to it me. It means the whole album is Kanye's. It's it's the public's pers perspective of Kanye, and that outro is where he's going. 
it, what it really means is that the public can hear him, but they don't understand. You're looking saying. way too deep into it's it, bro. True, though. He's just it's moaning true. into the microphone. This, this is magnum opus. This is what magnum opus magnum. is. Okay. No, I disagree. I think it's wrong. No, I don't listen to it compared, compared to every other album on the list. I don't listen to it as much as any other ones. The replay value is not as this good. This is a the take that nobody has ever made ever in history. That's not true. I'm, I'm shaking because I'm I know. I, 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 I'm really not like describing this well, but like I just don't have words for this because this is I, something. Do you I listen to this really more than any other, other, yes. other albums? Yes. I don't. That's I do. Why. I don't listen to it. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't, I don't listen to it. I don't. To everything but it's, else. it's up there. It's top three. Stuff I listen to by Kanye. That's 100%. fair. It's, it's a good 100%. album. It's a good it's, album. It's more than a good album. It's a great <coughs> album. All right. The rest of the albums are all great, but it's just ranking what's the worst. You're all a right. fool, well, bro. You're a fool. Let's explain why we have 808s. All right, yeah. You have so 808s there? I have um, 808s because, yeah, it's a great album. You know, it did so much for rap today. Highly influential. Highly. Very so influential, but... It's just not on that top six Kanye level for me. You know, it's just not not enough songs that I love from that album. I mean, that that tra that track run with uh, Bad News, Paranoid, mm -hmm. Robocop, Streetlights, that's just an amazing track run, but yeah, it's just like, I'm kind of it's a right. drop off. I, and I'm a big 808s guy. Yeah, no My disrespect to 808s. You know, it's a great, you know, Darian, yeah, you. That was I have vinyl CD, and CD. CD. Vinyl yeah. and CD. Wow. So that's actually kind of surprising. To yeah, have yeah I thought it was gonna be higher up on the list for you. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. It's higher up it's just, on mine. <sighs> it's just influential too. It's, it's most yeah, influential. No. That's why it's higher on mine. Three, two, one, flip. You guys are lame, bro. What? You guys are lame. I mean, he's gonna put yeah. that just because for whatever reason he put my beautiful dark bro, twisted fantasy my below oh. 808. Oh, man, you should leave. Yeah, I should leave. Get out of here. Go. Get out of here. All right, well, no. Yeezus. All right, let's talk. It's an experimental album, but it's not that experimental. People yeah. have done it before him. Death Grips have done it before him and uh, various other artists. Yeah, it's yeah. just not as experimental as people made it out to seem. And it's, it's a really great album still. Yeah, it's a great album. You know, uh, my, the songs I highlighted from it, obviously Bound to. Black Skinhead was the first Kanye song I ever got into because of Darian. Darian actually put me onto that song, and then... That's you know that's what I got. I got today. Hold my liquor. New slaves and guilt is my top three. It was an amazing song. Though. Yeah, and also it uh inf had, this album also had a lot of influence on uh Utopia. Travis yeah, Scott. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, Mo, you can come back now. You come back. Yeah. Number five. Ready? Three, two, one. Flip. My man. Wow. My man. Wow. My I man, thought right? that was gonna be my a hot man. take. My man, my man. You guys are we, copying each other, bro. We great minds think alike. Put that thing back on. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, graduation. I don't think it really aged well. No one's listened to Stronger before football game to get hyped. No one. No one's. No one's gonna listen to most of those albums right there. Uh, most of those songs on the album right there. But um, I mean, there's still some fantastic songs on there like uh, "Can't Tell Me Nothing," "Flashing mm -hmm. Lights." Yeah, it's a. It's a. This is the album that got me into Kanye. And, Same you know, here. once you kind of get, you listen to more Kanye, you kind of lose the love for graduation a little bit. You know, it still a, holds a great place in your heart just because of songs like Flashing Lights, Everything I Am, I have Good Morning, oh. great songs. Great, good Morning has probably the best Kanye music video. It's, it's such a great music video. But, Drunken Hot Girls, Barry Bonds. Yeah, that's th those are the albums that put it at five. Yeah. Do you have anything you want to say? Yeah, all right. But three, two, one, flip. Oh, wow! On. You see, I there, come there's on. no, I can't agree with my beautiful Darth Vader fantasy out of the top three. Look, it's a, it's a great album. It's a magnum opus, but it's just so many songs I don't listen to on there. It's still a great album, but I don't come back to Monster, Hell of a Life. You don't uh, come back to Hell of a Life? No, I don't. Hell of a Life is a great song. I don't come back to Who Will Survive in America? <laughs> <laughs> Who Will Survive in America? 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 Darian, can I ask you what you like about T-Lop so much? Because I know I it's mean, high on your list. Uh, T-Lop is very high on my list, but it's just a great album. It's a mix of all of his styles combined into one perfect album. I feel like there's the revisions that uh, came through with this album. I can I agree so with much. you. I think from here on out, like all the albums are just great. Like yeah, There's no yeah. wrong answer for the rest. Besides yeah. me, I kind of messed up at then, so my release is gonna be different from yours. 
Well, I put the life of Pablo, and this is obviously it's no hate because once you get to the top four of Kanye albums, it's just like you know, it's 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 diff it's better than anybody else. Yeah. Once you get to the top four, and this album is a masterpiece, but there are just a couple songs that I really just just can't get behind. Highlights. I love that song. I hate Young highlights. Thug. I oh. hate highlights. Like. How does it go? How does it go? How does it go? I'm not. Tell my mama I'm up to town. We live in the house. I don't know. Are you ready? Three, two, one, flip. What do we got here? Okay. Okay. I I, I can understand, okay. but this is my like. I didn't, I didn't even oh, see. Graduation. Okay. All right. You go. You, you can, can talk. Can we? Can this. we you agree? Can, can we agree yourself. that his first three albums are like easily some of his best? Yeah. By far. Yeah. That's yeah. all because. I wish we got good ass job, man. It's not gonna happen. It's never gonna happen. No, I don't think it would have. So been. many albums that we could have got. Yeah. That but if we never out. got, if we if we had good ass, we would never get show, graduation. We wouldn't got uh, the rest of his albums. Yeah, yeah you that's don't think true. So? We wouldn't have gotten my beautiful dark twisted fantasy. We wouldn't have gotten eight oh eights. We wouldn't have gotten the rest of his albums. Yeah. I think. All right, keep keep explaining. I put graduation there because I feel like I just like the other ones better. I just listen to this least out of all the other ones, and I feel like it's less influential than the f the next two that I have. Mm. I mean. I put late registration here because it's really a great album, a perfect fall album, but um, just don't come back to most of the songs either. Really? Yeah. Like that's major. That's, that's we hot. major. Bro? I come back. That's my most comeback. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I come back I to the album more than this we major. Heard him say roses. Roses. Like those are great songs. How does roses go? I know it's past visiting hours, okay. but can I please <laughs> give her these flowers? Bro, Kanye South over here. Not even Kanye's. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, I got. I put the college dropout. You know, that's a, I, that's not everyone's gonna agree with this one, and I'm just. It's obviously, <coughs> it's his first album. It's a great album. There's so many songs on this album, but it's just I like the I like the two other albums better. It's it, it's not it's no knock against this album. Spaceship, Jesus Walks, Last Call, Family Business. Family Business, man. There's no wrong answers at this point. Man, though. Family Business. It just really just gets me in that Thanksgiving feeling. It's such a great it really does. winter Thanksgiving. I was shoving Christmas. the snow to that song. <laughs> Number two. Three, two, one, flip. What's your number? Oh. Oh. Late registration. I put late registration. I put late registration, too. too. Late registration. This is my most listened to Kanye album, I'd say. We Major is my favorite Kanye song. Touch the Sky is all time great. Oh, my God. Drive slow. Drive slow, homie. <laughs> you never know, homie. You might meet some homie. You need to pump your brakes and drive slow, homie. Uh, Diamonds from Sierra Leone. It's just oh, a great album. Oh, that song album. is so good. You Nobody listens to that song. I love that song. It's it's. I used this album used to be outside of my top five, but once I started listening to Kanye more, I just really, really. For me, loved one and this album. one and two are so interchangeable for me. There's there's like yeah. a one A and one one B. Yeah, for me. I mean, I gotta give it to late registration. Well, for your first album, your debut album, you have your whole life to make it. Your second album, you only have a couple years to make it, so it's really just shows how great Kanye is and how great the album is. Yeah, and if you ever see the Netflix documentary Genius, it made this album just so much oh, yeah, cooler, culture. just because you saw everything being recorded and every, just, all the all the back behind the scenes of this album. The trilogy so is just hunger. So the trilogy hunger, is just so, so good. The trilogy is amazing. Ready, three, two, one, flip. Okay. Isn't it three different answers for the number one? I feel like you're both fools. All right, my beautiful Darth Vader's fantasy. It's it w it was a god's creation. He literally he was he flew out to Hawaii, flew out all the best artists to come make this masterpiece. Two weeks straight, three hours of sleep every night. He was just grinding on this album. He put everything into this album. I don't want to. I don't. I can't. I can't hear anything else other than my beautiful Darth Vader's fantasy being number one. I think the fact that we have three different answers says a lot. Yeah, yeah. it says a lot about how how great of an artist. He is, I mean, I can't agree with that. Why? I can't either. I can't agree I with can't that. Agree There's that. so I many can't agree better that ones. That is his best work. It's Number such one, a fun that, album. That's it's that's not his best, best work. Saint Pablo, FML, Father Stretch My Hands. But that's his. I don't think that's his best. It's work. not better than that. I don't think. Famous. Come on. No more parties in LA. No more parties in okay, LA. That's, that's a great, that's that's a great, great song. That's a great song. Best work. Kanye song. It's a mix of like the gospel, some OG Kanye, some 808s, everything into one great album. I like College Dropout because it's just 
It's just so raw. I think my beautiful dark twisted fantasy is the best though, just because it's it's never been done before, bro. Yes, it has. Yes, no, it, it has, has, bro. No one has done music like that. Yes, it has. Nobody has. has. Who has come close? Who uh, has come close? What's it, what's it called? To pimp a butterfly. That, to pimp, like, yes, it does. Yes, it does. Kendrick, like. Kendrick has two They're albums two better than albums. my beautiful dark twisted fantasy. It's just a. It's. I think it's overproduced. It's overproduced. I, don't, I, don't, I can't. I can't. I can't agree with that. Too many yeah, artists. You can do together. Yeah, I think there's too many artists on it. Thank you for watching our Kanye album rankings. Thank you for having me. Thank you.